Today we're going to learn how to draw hand turkeys and we're going to use oil pastels to do it. Oil pastels or crepas as they're called are kind of like crayons but they're a little bit waxier, a little more slippery. I think you'll have fun using them. So I just started by tracing my hand and now I'm adding the beak, the eye, the little dangling gobble, some feet for my turkey. I'm going to color in his beak orange and these Oil pastels have nice bright colors. I think you're going to really enjoy the way they look. And coloring his little gobble red. And adding that extra wing. And I'm just going to start coloring in his feathers. And I'm going to make a kind of rainbow turkey for fun, but you can make your turkey any way you want. You can do it a realistic brown turkey, New England turkey, or you can make it kind of fun colors like I'm doing. So I'm adding each one in a different color and just starting to fill in my turkey with oil pastel. And you want to try and color your whole turkey with oil pastels because we're going to go back over the background with watercolor and do a little watercolor resist technique. And you want your whole turkey to be colored in so that it doesn't, your watercolor doesn't get inside your turkey. So I'm adding some more colors. I want to have all the colors in my turkey. Really fun, festive turkey. And I'm making sure my whole turkey is filled in like we talked about. So when we go back with the watercolors, it won't go over my turkey. I'm just filling in all my gaps making sure my pastel gets everywhere in my turkey. And it's really fun with pastels to do multiple colors on top of each other. So I'm adding some dark green on top of my light green, kind of seeing what colors I can make by blending two pastels together. And I'm gonna write Happy Thanksgiving at the top, but you don't have to do that, that's optional. But it could be fun. And it's gonna be fun to see how the watercolor goes over those words. So now I'm going to start using my watercolor and as you can see you just dab lightly on top of your color. You don't need to scrub your brush in your watercolor. So you're going to keep adding water so that it goes on smooth and you can just go right on top of your oil pastel like I'm doing and since it's nice and waxy it resists the watercolor and you can still see your words in your turkey which is really cool. And I'm adding some grass under my turkey with my watercolors. And you can add even more things if you want trees or a house. It's up to you. It's your creation. I'm just going to keep it simple for this demo, but you can get as creative as you would like. And there you go. There's your hand turkey. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs>